Hey socialites, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Ariel. I create mainly beauty videos, fragrance, and lifestyle vlogs. So if that's the type of content you're into, go ahead and hit that subscribe button so you can become a socialite. So today's video is right on time. You guys, I'm gonna be doing a full review and wear test of the Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow All-in-One Tinted Moisturizer. Now I did get a request to do a full review of this like a couple months ago. I could not find it in my color you guys and it was sold out on Ulta so I was recently able to pick it up and it's still 21 days of beauty with Ulta today happens to be the day that this particular product is 50% off now this Smashbox Halo tinted moisturizer is infused with skincare it's supposed to be super hydrating infused with hyaluronic acid that gives you 24 hours of hydration as well as a built-in primer that gives you all day wear with this product it's supposed to be crease proof and sweat and humidity resistant so we'll be the judge of that I'm definitely gonna get a wear test for you guys now the regular price of this skin tint is $41 it is on sale for $20.50 today I was also able to pick up the Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow Perfection Pen which is like an all-in-one situation you can use this mainly as concealer you could go brighter to highlight with you can actually get a darker color and use it to contour as well so I'm gonna be showing you how I use this as well this is another product that's 50% off today the regular price is $21 today you'll be able to pick it up for $14.50 I'll have both of these products linked in the comments and the description box for your convenience so yeah if you want to see how I got this look using these two Smashbox products then keep on watching okay socialites so here's the outer packaging it's just a regular cardboard box that says Smashbox Halo on here and healthy glow all-in-one tinted moisturizer it does have a SPF of 25 in it the top does have your color on the top now the actual bottle of the tinted moisturizer is almost like the typical tinted moisturizer packaging which is basically a plastic squeeze tube that has a matte black top that you twist off and it squeezes off when a teeny tiny little hole per the directions it does say to shake the product well before use now whenever I do my foundation or skin tint reviews I like to put it on bare skin no primers no sort of skincare underneath so we can see how it performs on bare skin and that makes it easier for me to recommend the best primer for you now this particular tinted moisturizer is especially interesting because it has a built-in primer so this could be used as a tinted primer and then you put whatever foundation you want to use on top whether that be a powder foundation or another liquid foundation or you could sort of use this as just a tinted moisturizer that has your primer in it the website does state for you to use your fingers to apply so I am going to use my fingers on one side and a brush on the other just because I do prefer a brush I'm gonna squeeze about that much and this is a bit warmer I do prefer my foundations and skin tints to be slightly warmer I wish I would have got the neutral shade I feel like dark neutral which is one shade lighter than this would have been perfect but they didn't have dark neutral in stock and then the shade above that which is tan deep I did go back and forth between the color that I have now which is dark warm and tan deep on the other side and I was a very close match to both really really close but I just preferred to go with the warmer shade because this has a built-in primer the claims is that this gives you all day wear so far I do like the way it applies with the fingers for this to be a glowy product as well and it does look very supple and glowy on the skin I love that in a foundation by the way but it doesn't feel like sticky or oily at all which is interesting as well I like that so this is warm on my skin I feel like dark neutral would have been perfect but I don't mind warm so on the other side I'm gonna go ahead and use a brush I'm gonna use the real techniques 200 brush just to see how it applies with the brush I'm gonna take the same amount of product which is about that much and I like how it comes out of the tube as well it comes out sort of you have to squeeze the tube for it to come out it is a liquid but it's not a super thin liquid that runs so I do like that you squeeze it out because I feel like you get more control and it's like you're not squeezing out and wasting so much product
off the bat I do see that you get a little bit more control and slightly more coverage using your fingers so I do like how it applies with the fingers versus the brush it just gets a little bit more even with your fingers which is what they recommend this product is definitely giving medium coverage so I would say this will give you light to medium coverage I also want to add that the skin tint does come in 20 shades and about half of them would probably work for african-american skin tones which to me is very impressive to highlight and brighten back up the face I'm gonna take the new uh, Hoss Labs concealer using the color number 40 I'm gonna blend my highlight with my Sonia Kashuk blending sponge. You do get the best out of this concealer by letting it sit on the face for a minute or two. I'm gonna go in with one more layer of concealer. I'm gonna use my same foundation brush to blend out the contour. To set my highlighted areas, I'm going in with the Laura Mercier Loose Translucent Powder. To bronze my face, I'm gonna use the Sephora Micro Smooth Powder. This one's in the color Ebony with an angled blush brush from Japanesque. Going in with my Charlotte Tilbury Chic to Chic Blush in the color Intense. Another product that I wanted to introduce to you, I should have showed you earlier, I forgot, but I'm glad that I didn't put powder down here, which is where I need coverage. So this is the Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow Perfection Pen. This product is also 50% off today, you guys. I'll leave the color in the comments and the description box. But this is basically like a concealer pen this is hydrating as well it's infused with hyaluronic acid it says you can use this as concealer you can contour with it whatever so it just depends on it's like one of those all-in-one pens that you can use for anything you want to use it for i picked up my skin tone so i'll be using this to basically conceal but if you get a darker color you can contour if you you can get brighter if you want for a bright highlight you could just sort of play around with this product so it does sort of twist up it's taking a while so it starts to come out and I'm just gonna put this in the areas that I need the coverage and this is basically my skin tone as you can see it matches my neck so this is closer to my skin tone than the actual skin tint like I said earlier the skin tint is a little warm if you're my shade twin and you don't want to go warm you want to go neutral be sure to get the color dark neutral so the concealer pen is actually thicker than the actual skin tint and it gives a lot more coverage than the skin Content. like this is giving full coverage so you only need a tiny bit of this stuff I love the way it covers wow because that was a pretty dark mark let's see about that mark yeah this is giving full coverage and it it lays real smooth it's supposed to be crease proof as well and it blends right in fairly easy I actually really like that so the regular price of the concealer pen is $29 and today it's on sale for $14.50 I'm gonna actually use my concealer brush to take a little bit of the concealer that seeped out and sculpt my brows
yeah this definitely gives full coverage it looks natural too okay so i'm gonna finish the rest of my face and come back and show you the final look so this is the final look for eyeshadow i did use the nars orgasm rising palette for lips i use the juvia's place lip liner in the color cola with elf lipstick in the color hustle and dior gloss in shimmer macadamia claims are per the website that this skin tint is supposed to last all day with 24 hours of hydration so we'll be the judge of that it's now 12 24 p.m so i'm gonna wear the skin tint for a few hours come back and let you guys know my final thoughts okay socialites so i'm back it's now raining cats and dogs <laughs> hopefully you guys can't hear that but it's 4 45 so it's a little bit after four hours later and this is what we have i haven't blotted or touched my face at all i feel like this is a very beautiful skin tint the glow is really glowing you know what i mean i love that i love that it has slight plumping in it i can tell by how my fine lines look typically with a foundation that doesn't have plumping technology i can see the lines sort of crease so i like how it's sort of filled out here that was like a nice surprise no fine lines or pores you can see where sort of the natural shine starts to come out a little bit in these areas which may be a little bit of the bronzer showing through but just natural oils are showing through but it's not oily so at this four hour mark i do feel like this is something that will be oily girl approved if you have oily skin i think you'll be okay and the fact that it has that primer in there that helps with the longevity a bit now if you want it a little extra like if you're somebody with super oily skin my skin is pretty much normal to combo definitely not dry but if your skin is oilier than mine then you may want to put a little bit of your oil controlling primer underneath but you may be able to get away with no primer being that it's built in the formula as far as who this product is for i think both products would work for any skin type it is hydrating so it'll definitely work for somebody with a dry skin being that i don't have dry skin whatsoever and it works for me like this at the four hour mark i definitely feel like it'll work perfectly for somebody with oily skin so this product will work for anyone if you're looking for the perfect skin tint that gives you sort of that light to medium coverage that will be long lasting all day and have a pretty good shade range this might be for you don't forget both of these products are currently 50% off until midnight I want to say so click the link in the comments or in the description box to check that out if you're new here welcome I would love for you to come join the family by hitting the subscribe button thank you all so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one Cause too fresh with the scars What I don't have the answer